It's your ma. Mama. Come. Mama, I'm coming. Mama. Mama. Sit down, sit down, sit down. There's something Mama. I want to ask you. Sit down, sit down. Sit. Mm. Yeah. Okay. It's your ma. Mama. The prince was here when I went out. Yes, Mama. He, he left five minutes before you returned. Good. Have you not accepted his proposal till now? No, Mama. Why? Mama, were you expecting me to just accept like that? Th that's, that's me being cheap now. You see, Mama? Mama. You see, Adikwa, give me Are you okay? What are you waiting for? Mama, see, you have to understand that just because he's a prince doesn't mean that if he, uh, he proposes to me, I'll just say yes like that. Yeah. Mama, I don't need to be cheap now. I need to package it myself. Mm -hmm. Yes, now. Just because that we are, uh, we are poor mama doesn't mean that I, I don't know my value and my worth. You are very correct. I am my mother's daughter. Mm. He has to calm down. Mm. Yes, mama. I know what yes, I am doing. Yes, mama. Yes, mama. Another five. Take it. Mm. I know what I am doing. Take it again. Take yes. it again. <laughs> mm. I know what I'm doing. But my daughter, you have to be very careful. There's this adage we say pride goes before a fall. No pride, though. And I'm with him. Please, 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 don't take too much time. Before somebody else come from the other side and Mama, come there's nobody else. Yeah, sure. For now, I am blinding him. Yeah! You cannot see I another trust person. you. <laughs> I trust hey, you. Mama, hmm? you don't know. Let me shock you so that you see that I know what I am doing. Okay. So, the prince. You mean that church rat asked me to come and see him instead? Okay. That boy is a nuisance. And he must think he must be high on something. Can you imagine a human being in his right senses turning down a royal invitation, insisting that the king must come and see him? Think he's high on something. On a word it. We need a chief priest, or the father will be meaningless. Igwe. The only solution to the problem now is to take away the mantle of chief priest from all the family. That's all. Uh, but you know that is not possible. Igwe, it, 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 it could be possible. Greetings, Father. Greetings, Honor. Uh, the Crown Prince. <laughs> no. Thank you, Honor. Oh, Father, there is something I want to discuss with you. Probably when you're done with your know, we can talk. I hope there's no problem. Oh, Father, all is well. I'll be in my room when you're done with him yourself. It's okay, I'll do those things. All right, fine. Thank you. Mm. I don't know what to this place. Yeah. We have to do something. We just have to come with this. Well, if you insist, eh? mm. problem. I give you that job. You have to convince him, even if it means bribing him. Mm -hmm. Talk to it. Uh. We need somebody who will be communicating with the gods on our behalf. Uh. Well, no problem. I'll do just that. <laughs> please, uh, I see that you have stopped taking your drink. Please. Uh, oh my God! Oh my God! If it is, that one, I don't know. It has been there for a long time. Oh no! This one, that one. You are free. You are free. Guys. I think I'll go there and check them out by tomorrow. You can handle it. Yes, I know I can handle it. Hey, Omalita. Do you know that Nzeribe's girlfriend very well? I mean, who is she? And do you think she is suitable for the prince? Okay, her name is Isioma. She's a beautiful girl. But she's the daughter of a nobody. Yes, I know that her name is Isioma. What I'm asking is... If she is suitable for the prince? For me, I would say no. 
because she's an undergraduate. And I believe anybody that's going to replace you, the queen of this kingdom, should be a graduate. So my son is dealing with an illiterate. Mom, I didn't say so. I only said she's an undergraduate. We are saying the same thing. You see? Being an undergraduate is madness. We are in a computer age. And whoever that will pilot the leadership of any society, state or country, must be well wired, well educated, so that he or she can contend with other intellectuals in the international level. Hmm? But mom, you know, you can still send her to the university. With which money? I mean, who will bear the expenses of her education? Me or the king? No, it's not possible. It's not possible. There are so many educated maidens in this society. We can pick one for him. Did you say so? Yes, I said so. <laughs> I don't think money is a problem when it comes to your son. I am saying Please, I want you to do me a favor. What favor? I want you to give me your turn to clean the prince room. In fact, eh, I want to be cleaning his room every day and every time. What do you want with the prince? Good question. You know, eh, I had a dream. And in this dream, I was crowned the queen. Men, women were bound down to my feet. In fact, eh, I was sitting down in the right side of King Zeri being cut out the two. <laughs> Bravo. <laughs> Excellent dream. <laughs> Are you sure you're not feverish? Amanda, I'm fine. I'm fine now. Do what I asked you to do, eh? Please get my ministry. <laughs> okay. You can clean the prince room. But please, be careful so you don't get into trouble. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you, much. I love you. Don't worry, eh? In my ministry, eh? I'll remember you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure this girl is okay? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Son, Father, have you told your mother and sister? Yes, I already sent the guard to call them. <sighs> May you live long, my king. Please sit. Okay. Good day, Mom. Good day, my son. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm good. Alright. And you? How are you? All right. Uh, so you can now go ahead to tell us what you want to say as your mother and sister are here. Okay. Um. Thank you, Father, for giving me this opportunity. Uh, my father, my mother, and my beautiful sister, Malicha. Uh, what I'm about to say is what I believe everyone has always waited for. I won't really say much. Oh. I just want to inform the family that I have found my missing rib. Yes. I'm ready to bring the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with so my family can meet her. This is great news. Oh. Thank you, Father. Well, did you hear that? This is the kind of news I always want to hear. <sighs> yes. Thank you, Father. Oh, so when is she coming? Oh, by noon tomorrow. Uh, Lord, please, you have to inform the maidens and all the stewards in the palace to prepare because we have to give her a very warm welcome. Thank you, Father. Tomorrow must be a very special day. Thank you, Father. I will do just that. Good. All right. Uh, Father, I want to rush to the markets to get something. Why? Why am I paying the servants in the house? Send them and I will get it for you. Oh, I'm ahead of Father. Well, it's on time. It's private. I need to go get it myself. Mm. Yeah. If you say so, but, uh, you have to take care of yourself. 
I will, Father. And don't forget that tomorrow is a special day. <laughs> Thank you very much, Father. Thank you. May I take my leave? Father, excuse me. My king, why are you so serious about bringing in a girl you don't even know? Huh? A day begins a story. Tomorrow, we all will know who she is. Uh, my king, I want to tell you something. What kind of a question is that? Is your mom, of course. No. You can't bring that girl to the house. She's a nobody. She's not your class. She's not your standard. Can't you get it through? Whatever you had with that guy, I thought it should have ended on the street. She's not up to the level you're going to bring to the house. Do you want to share my parents? And Why bring her to the house? I told you you're somebody. Yes. Who told you you're somebody? Now listen to me. You and every other girl on the streets were created the same. You're different. You're probably lucky having a royal blood. And that doesn't make you better than any girl on the streets, even the market to women. Now listen to me. I will let you go because you're my sister. And I love you so much. Next time you stop me to see such trash from that your mouth, you will not like what I would do to you. Choose wisely, bro. She's not your class. You're a prince and you deserve better. Don't you think we should uh, inform a GK? About what, my king? About the coming of Prince Nzeribe's fiancé. My king, why are you publicizing this? Publicizing what? Is a GK no longer part of this family? He is my first son. And the only clergy in this royal household. He needs to see the person that his brother wants to marry. And perhaps he may have his own personal observations on the girl. My king, please. Let's not bother him over nothing. We can take care of the visitor. Besides, AGK is an ordained priest of God. Let's allow him concentrate on the things of God. He is running his heavenly race, crying out loud. You can hear yourself. Don't blame me when I strip him of everything that has to do with this royal house. Do not complain then. Why is your skirt up? What is this now? What do you want? Please be going to the prince with some go. Which prince? The prince that just drove out? Are you serious? 
clean the room fast. The queen wants to see us. I don't know what you're up to. God promises this one safe. I was coming to the parish to call you. My son is dying. Your son is dying? Yes, Father. What is wrong with him? Father, I don't know. I don't know, Father. Please, I don't want anything to happen to my son. Help me, please. Please. As water <laughs> reflects the fate of the face, so one's life reflects the heart. <laughs> We walk in faith. We walk in faith. Yes, Father. Glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. Come in. Mm. Commander, please just leave me alone. Just leave me alone because you don't know how I'm feeling right now. How are you feeling? Will you stop this madness? Mother, leave me alone now. Leave me alone. I'm in pain right now. Let me just cry out my sorrows. Just leave me alone. You're in pain. Let you cry out your sorrows. You better be careful and stop this madness. Just go away now. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I blame the priest that is always breaking my heart anyhow. I don't blame you. <laughs> Here comes the queen of Kumoku Kingdom. Papa, how does your baby look? Oh, God. Papa, are you mad? Who do you want to follow dressing like this? Me? Yes, of course. You. Papa, this is the outfit that will entice the Igwe and capture the prince's attention. Oh, God. Papa, did you use the mirror before coming out? Are you saying you don't like my outfit? Papa, check it out now. Papa, check it out. Mm. Again, no. Eh? My friend, go in and change. Don't be stupid. Papa, that means the visit to the palace is no more possible, Lou. What do you mean by that? You look like a prostitute. And I have already told the Igwe that we are coming. Go and change and don't waste my time. Papa, Papa, you know I like dressing like this. And this is one of my best outfits. Oh, God. Papa. I said, go inside and change. Papa, you guys took it, girl. But go inside, we're not going home. What is it? Why are you here crying? What can I do for you, my princess? I just asked you a question. 
Why are you here crying? It's, 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 it's nothing it's I should be bothered about. I lost my best friend. Get me a glass of fruit juice. Oh Lord, my father. Oh Lord, my God. Oh Lord, my King. Your servant besieges you. I beg you, O oh Lord, through the intercession of your archangels, Michael, Gabriel, Raphael, set this boy free. Deliver him, O oh Lord. For he is being enslaved by the enemy. He is being enslaved by evil. Sickness is not the reason you brought him to earth, Lord. For it is said that he who the Son of Man has set free Indeed, is free. Amen. Junior, as the son of the Most High God, I set you free today Amen. from the bondage of Satan, from the bondage of evil. Junior, Junior, I speak life into you. Amen. I speak life into you. Amen. I speak life into you. Amen. Glory be to Jesus. Honor to Mary. Glory be to Jesus. Honor to Mary. Glory be to Jesus. Honor to Mary. Wake up. Wake up, my boy. Junior. Wake up. Junior. Hey, Father, he's alive. He's alive, Father. Hey. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. My son is alive. Oh. Would you want to eat? Glory be to God. Are you hungry? Yes. Good. Do you have food for him? Yes, Father, there is food. All right. Please get him food. Okay, Father. Okay. Hey. Hey. My son. Yes, my boy. Yes. You're free, my boy. Yes. No, as in, you mean uh, you have a grown-up daughter like this? Yes, Your Majesty. Uh, she's my second daughter. Although my first daughter died three years ago. So she's my first by process. Has she been alone? No, Your Majesty. She has been away for so long. She's just coming back from Rwanda. Rwanda. Yes, Your Majesty. My daughter, how is Rwanda? Your Majesty, Rwanda is just there. Oh, you are talking to the Igwe and you are sitting down. You are a woman. You are no more in Rwanda. Hi. 
sorry about that. It was just... Sorry, Your Majesty. It's okay, it's fine. Uh, what part of Rwanda did you come from? Kumasi, Your Majesty. Kumasi. Kumasi? I thought Kumasi is in Ghana. Yes, Your Majesty, but that's a Kumasi tribe. And that's by the way, Your Majesty. Please, where is Kumasi? Why are you looking for the prince? Nothing much, Your Majesty. We just have a lot to talk about. Have you met him before? Your Majesty, the prince. Mazim Kumbe. Let her speak for herself. Sorry. My daughter, go on. Your Majesty, the prince is a popular person. I've met him a couple of times on the road. We have time to talk with each other. Your Majesty, she's a very nice girl. I try to have her. Yes. I can see. Yeah. <clears throat> It's all right. Okay. I don't know how to thank you, Father. All glory belongs to God. All right? Mm. I am just a new student. God Good. bless you, it Father. It is okay. It's okay. Thank you, Father. It's all right, my boy. Huh? Um, please, like I said, um, bring him to the parish in the evening. Okay? Will, okay? No, good, no, no. good. You'll come to the parish in the evening, okay? This boy is going to be great. Yes, Father. I Thank saw you, Father. it. Yes, yes. He's going to be great. And he's going to be very famous too. Yes, Father. I'm telling you. Thank you. Father. You know you're going to be great. Yes. You know you're going to be famous. Yes. Good. Now give me five. I have something for you when you come to the parish, okay? Yes. Don't fail to bring him this evening. I still have a lot to tell him. Not fail, okay? Father. I'll bring All right. Thank okay. you very much, okay. Father. Teresa, I want you to advise your husband. Let him take up his responsibility as the chief priest of the kingdom. I don't know what to tell my husband. Iko has refused to be useful to himself. Talk to him more. Work on him. Tell him that his refusal to take up his responsibility eh, is the reason we will not celebrate this year's of Allah. Let him understand it. No, are you serious? Of course I am. Even at that, you don't even know that it is because he could refuse to be the chief priest that is the reason for your childlessness. I go, it, I, you don't go, you don't ask people. Go and ask people. I, I, I don't understand what you mean my husband is the reason for our childlessness. Please explain. Let me tell you. He could refuse to step in the shoes of his father as the chief priest and the gods became angry. Instead of punishing the, 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 the person that caused it, the gods punished you. Hey. Oh yes, they heaped the punishment on you. Oh, are you speaking the truth? Yes, that's why you will not have it. Even in the near future, you will not have until you go and the, the, the gods. Oh, no wonder. I'm trying my best. Go and try more, Teresa. Tell him to take up his responsibility. Let him. It's, it's very simple. Answer the call of the gods. That's all. That's all. Then you see how fertile you'll be. Advise him. Oh, no way. I, I, I will try my best. Aduma, advise him. Iko will not kill me. So Iko is the reason for our childlessness. 
what have I got myself into? Oh no, well, thank you. Hey. Because. So, now that I have introduced you to my parents, oh, my family oh. precisely, um, I hope you feel good. And what is next? Um, I should be asking you. Uh, but I didn't really like the attitude your mother gave me. Oh, my mother. Yep. My mother, my sister, yeah, I know, I know. But at the same time, you of all people should know how mothers behave when it comes to things like this. Even at that, I still feel she doesn't like me. Oh, come on. Does that really matter? It doesn't matter if she likes you or not. All that matters is I like you so much. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> Yeah, I want to be with you. Moreover, my father, yeah. He likes you so much. And he said to me, yeah, he said, my son, you're a true son of your father. You have good eyes. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so, fine. Uh -huh. But I think this has a little bit of a oh, Yep, little, little, it, will, it will trigger the thing, I think. Oh. Yes. I brought it from God. I, yeah, little, little, but at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Your, oh. your Majesty. Mom. Isoma, can I have a word with you alone? Yes, my queen, you can. Yeah. Um. Upcoming queen. Mm. Hmm? When you're done talking to my mother, meet me inside. Okay? Okay. All right. Teresa! Teresa! Have you never seen a prisoner before? See, if you are interested in love, then go and carry it. Nico, you are the cause of our problem. Take the phone and liberate us from childlessness. See, let me tell you. I am not interested. Because I don't want to do the same mistake my father did. Nico, do you know the gods are angry with you? And that is why they have turned their back on us. Do the right thing and you see breakthrough in all you do. The gods have turned their back on me. I don't believe that. Have you ever seen the gods happy before? They are always sad, sad, sad as if I were here yesterday. See, let me tell you something. If the gods want me to serve them, they should better change their ways. Then I will follow them. Hiko, you are actually going crazy. You are going nuts. Me? Yes. Going nuts. How dare you speak to the gods like that? Do you want to incur the wrath of God upon yourself? Which not? Which not are you talking about? See, if the gods are interested, then you should look for somebody against the side that I'm not interested. Are you, are you, are you hearing me? See, are you are disturbing me, oh. You must take that offer. You must take that offer as long as I'm alive. I must take your offer. I must take your offer, B. Go and get your gun and shoot me. See, tell you, let me tell you something. I'll marry a second wife for you. I'll marry a second wife for you. Over my dead body, will you bring a second wife to this house? Okay. I must carry my own children. I must be a children for you. My own children are in my pocket. They are in my pocket. You, 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 you must go and take that off. Oh. You must go and take it. I must get, I, 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 I must get a child. That's a, that's a I, don't, I don't know if I did a mistake by marrying you. I don't know. You did a business by marrying an evil spirit? Yeah? You did a business by marrying an evil spirit? You must think that's our fault! My children is in my pocket. Now tell me, what did you give to my son? 
With all due respect, my queen, I seriously do not understand the question. Um, okay, um, let me break it down to your understanding because we all know how daft you are. My mom means, what did you give to the prince to eat? I mean, what charm did you use on him? Because ordinarily, the prince will not come for your kind. Can you start talking already? Um, uh, my queen, I... I don't deal with charms, not to talk more of using it on someone. I, I've never seen it. I don't have any business with charms. I know you used charm on my son. Because I know my son very well. He likes educated ladies. I mean, well-exposed ladies. How come he descended so low to come for a thing like you? A secondary school dropout. Huh? You surprised me, Sioma. Start talking. Do you want us to make this whole community unbearable for you? Do you? No. Um. Say the truth. Now listen to me. Listen very carefully. I don't want to see you anywhere close to my son again. Else, you will regret being born into this land. Now smell out of my face. I mean, get out of my sight. Yes. Whatever seed you sow, that you must reap. mara mara. Yaki Gawara Eme Buna Wobin No Kanya Kaya Diocha Pachara Nyagi Do not hurt an innocent in a nuqua Pachara Nyagi God is the voice to the voiceless oh. My prince. Where is she? Ah. She's gone. No? She's gone. Why did you let her cross the gate without my permission? Hey. Hey. Ah. Sorry, oh. Sorry. What is going on? Is your man left angrily? My king, forget that thing. You don't have to worry yourself about her. She's not important. Can someone tell me what's going on? My princess, can you talk to me? Just talk to me. Father, we told her the bitter truth. Like Mother rightly said, she's not important. My daughter, please, come and get your father a glass of wine from here. He needs to cool off first. Okay. Now, both of you should leave my presence now. I say leave my presence now. My king, are you angry? Leave my presence! my queen. Where is my son? Your son? Eh? He ran along with the girl. Oh. He ran along with the girl? Yes, my queen. Okay. Do not allow him drive out of this compound. Did you hear me? Eh, yes, my queen. Did you hear me, Ago? Yes, my queen. Good. I said, open that gate. My prince, I cannot open the gate. <laughs> Smile, I'm a I can't. What did you say? I mean, 
I can't open the gate though. You see my hand? I'm on the cab. So, you see? Hmm? I mean, I can't. Pushing that one. Do I know? And why is she dressed like that? <gasps> I never knew Isioma can be this beautiful. What? Wait, 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 Urena. Are you admiring my enemy? Ah, no, I am not admiring her. I was only appreciating the handwork of makeup, foundation. Ha! <gasps> Did you see the kind of dress she's wearing? Would you? That dress must be very expensive, rich. I wonder where she got the money from to get that kind of a dress. Maybe the prince bought it for her. Hey, hey don't, don't even say that. Are hmm? you trying to make me jealous? Hmm? Don't say that. What do you mean by maybe the prince? I was only guessing. Don't guess. Don't the guess. The fittings in that clothing, the dress, I mean. Urena. It's perfect. Hmm? Do you want to be her friend? Mm -mm. Your, your friend. Your friend. Well, let's go. Hmm? Oh, this way. This way. Oh. What is the problem here? She's fine. Why it's only a fool that says there's no God. My friend, my grace has disgraced you. <laughs> hey. hey. Who has your grace disgraced? Amanda, are you not in this palace? Do you see what just happened? Uh, I am, and I witnessed what happened. Mm -hmm. But how does that make you happy? My God is fighting for me. My dream is gradually coming to pass. Do you know the reason why the queen rejected the girl that the prince brought is because of me? <laughs> because I am the chosen one. Hey! <laughs> oh, God. Hey! 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 Mm -hmm. Keep dreaming. Mm -hmm. oh. I don't blame you. I know you're envious. You're envious of my success. But you know what? I will not let you spoil my happiness. <laughs> Peru down the para. Peru. Tell me now. Eh? I cannot go back to.
don't want anyone to insult me for that. What is it? Babe, come on, come on, stop it. Yes, I, I understand my, my mother and my sister can, can they don't like you. They, they, can, they can be funny sometimes. But listen, my father loves you so much. He likes you. Moreover, I'm the one getting married to you, so consider me not them. Listen, I am begging you, just go back to your, your palace. I do not want this kingdom to be so uncomfortable for me. And who said Please. so? Issue. How can this kingdom be uncomfortable for you when I'm there? Listen to me, babe. I am ready to sacrifice my life, my last blood to protect you. No one in this kingdom can make this kingdom uncomfortable for you. It's not going to happen. Never. Come on, please. Please, believe me. I love you so much. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Come on. Let's go. Please. I'm going to enter the car, leave me, but I'm not going to go back to that palace. So. All right, fine, fine. Girl is not good enough for our son. That was why I sent her away. If I may ask Lolo, what is wrong with that girl? Everything is wrong with her. Starting from her level of education to her appearance. Did I hear you say appearance? Yes. Is she not beautiful? Beautiful indeed. Beauty derived from makeover. Well, I don't care how she looks like. All I know is that my son will not marry her. There is nothing wrong with that girl. She is suitable for our son. She is not suitable for our son. Lolo, are you challenging me? I am not challenging you, my king. Please, let us not start. That girl is a commoner. She's not worth fighting for. And I don't want us to make mistakes just because we are eager to get him a wife. That girl is good for our son. And we must support him to marry her. Mm -mm. My words are final. What is wrong? Why is she not picking her calls? Or oh, is her battery low? I don't think so because there used to be constant light. Where will she be? She not picking her calls. What has happened to her phone? Let's go stand like so. There's no reason why that phone should. The battery should be down by now. No. Something is wrong. Something is wrong. Something. It's definitely wrong.
Yes. You have to take me to that girl's house now. It's your mom's house? Yeah. Hmm. It's not a wise thing to do. Don't you think it's going to make her feel like she's important? I don't care. Take me to her house now. Okay, let me tell Ago to prepare the car. No, drive me yourself. If you can't, give me the key. No, <laughs> of course I'll drive it. Uh, where's the car key? It's with Ago. Okay, let's go. Hold on now, wait. Would you? Would you? Would you? Hold on. The angel of my life. Hi, how are you doing? You must be very stupid. See, if you know what is good for you, get out of my way. Calm down. Calm down. Huh? My love, why are you angry? Huh? My love, why? Why are you angry? You're very stupid, as you became. You're, in fact, you're senseless. Get out of my way. Calm down, calm down. Eh? Who offended you? Look, tell me I'll go and fight the person. Who offended you? It's your ancestors that offended me. It's your... My love, do you know you are talking to your love? Azubike, your love. love your one and you only. There. Love kill you, there, Azubike. You're very stupid. Hey. See, don't even try me. My Get love. out of my way. My love, please, look. I'm going to fight whoever I offended. said... I'm don't... telling you, my love. Azubike, please. don't touch me. Please, my love. Come back. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. What is this? Would you? Who offended you? I must know who offended you. Would you? Hi! You need to see the way the prince beats me. Kicked me. Oh! He dealt with me as if I was a nobody. Ha! That steps you right. Eh? Yeah? You are showing yourself too much in this palace. Uh -uh. What is wrong with you? Eh? Bia Biaela! What are you saying? Eh? What's the meaning of that now? I'm telling you what the prince did to me and you're even adding more. Eh? What's your problem? But wait though. What even gave you the right to tell the prince that you want to open the gate for him? Eh? The prince of this kingdom. What came over you? Ha! So, 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 sometimes eh? I wonder if you even have ear. You, you sometimes you used to talk like Tolo Tolo. Eh? Eh, 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 don't even call me Tolo Tolo again though. No. Respect yourself. Respect yourself. Eh? See, let me ask you one question. If it was you, the queen gave order, what will you have done? <laughs> and see what that got you, eh? You refused to open the door for the prince, Abi. You see what it has gotten to you? Look, eh, I'm busy. I just came back from the market and I have some things I'm doing in the kitchen. I don't have your time, oh? <laughs> You better hurry up, oh. you know I'm on drugs. You better hurry up. So, so, so sometimes, eh, you, the way you people do something in this palace, I wonder if you people even understand what is going on, eh? I'm, I'm, I'm saying what is my problem. You, you are there saying nonsense. Na query. Ndala. Nonsense. What is the problem? Where is my son? My queen, your son is not here. Your son should be in the palace with my daughter. Or did you not see them before you came from the palace? What stupid question is that? Mom, it's obvious this old witch over here is lying to you. Why not you go inside and check for yourself? Are you out of your senses? I'm sure Prince Nzeribe is here. How can you ask me to go inside this mess? Do you want my skin to spoil? You go there and bring out my son. Come on, Mama. You, I can't go in there. That place think like hell. You want me to suffocate? Madam, go inside and bring my brother out here. Yes, go there and bring out my son. Your son is not here. And I'm also looking for my daughter if that is the case. 
Shut up. You are comparing your stupid daughter with my son. Your daughter that doesn't even have a life. Listen, woman. I give you till nightfall to produce my son. Okay? Else, your body will tell you what I will do to you. Now let me advise you, old woman. Whatever you think the native doctor gave you, that you gave to your daughter to give to my own brother, has failed. Go and tell him that it has failed. It did not work. Yes. I did not give my daughter any chance. Shut your stupid mouth. I will soon have your time. But for now, I don't have your time. Hold on. I'm also looking for my daughter. I hope it is clear. Mom, please, I am looking for my daughter. The more reason so we'll both share that 25 hours. We should to call hours. the guards. We will share the 24 hours. You can imagine what gets That's it clear. <laughs> you can imagine what to even talk about. I'm giving my word. Yes, very good. I'm looking for my daughter. You're looking for your son. You're giving me 24, 24 hours. Both of us will share the 24 hours. You use 12 to look for your son. I use 12 to look for my daughter. Whatever seed you saw that you must reap. Mpuri kurunuwa kimara ya kigaworo. You shouldn't have done that. No. You shouldn't have chased that girl away. Nzerbe is an adult. He should marry anybody he deems fit to marry. That is it. I disagree with you, father. I will not have you call him that, Lolo. While I, the father, is still here, call him by his name. But my king, that is his profession. He's an ordained priest of God and should be addressed properly. Besides, charity begins at home. Are you trying to thwart my effort? Mm -hmm. <laughs> 